Hello, other warlocks. This is your friendly neighborhood warlock, Kadosh, and we are back at Bioshock. I hope the lighting is better now. I just, I just looked at the recording that I just did, and uh, th I think there was too many, too many shadows on my faces. On my faces, I only have one face. What am I talking about here? I, so I, I turned on a couple extra lights. I, th I, I think it looks a little better. Hopefully, it, sh it should look better. Ryan tells me it's a side effect of this plasmid business. One poor sod's memory is getting passed on to another through genetic sampling. Leaks. Lunatics. Rebellion. And now, bleeding ghosts. Ain't life in rapture, Greg. Anybody here? I heard you. Whoa! Oh, yes. The Houdini Splicers. Yes, that's right. <laughs> Hello. Jesus. Ah. I'll just uh I like your little uh druid mask. Worshipping the god Maliki or Malachi. Whoa! I just want to research you and then kill you. No, we don't have to we don't have to make this any harder than it is. Anything else going on around here? Just want to do a quick search around. Whoa! What's up? Easy. So, last we left off, I believe, uh... Atlas's family was just killed. And, uh, why do I believe it literally just happened? Hey, Whoa! Here! Increased damage, who do you need to... Of course they're vulnerable to anti-personal rounds. Almost every living thing is. Show up behind me, please. Nope. Fine. Whatever. Whatever. I will... I'll research you and kill you anyway. <coughs> Jesus! You know, Bioshock's still... It's still surprising that it's still... Well, I shouldn't say it's still... Well... It still manages to scare me here and there. Oh. Alright. Well, that's really impressive after playing through this game as playing through this game as many times as I have. Because there's really not a lot that I don't know that I that I don't expect. Because it's a fucking fantastic game. Why wouldn't I play it multiple times over and over again? Today Arcadia was closed off to all but paying customers. If a man hires me to build a forest at the bottom of the ocean and then turns a walk in the woods into a luxury. Riot asked. Should a farmer not be able to sell his food? Is a potter not entitled to a profit from his pots? Oh, I started to argue with a man, and then I remembered who signed my checks. The only thing worse than a hypocrite is an unemployed one. You know, I, I don't take a lot of political stances, but I do, I'm not a fan of capitalism. And that's, and that's, that's all you'll get out of me. Charging people for money for a walk to the park. Fucking crazy ass shit. Crazy ass shit. So, we are going to go. No. Wait. Wait. So. Uh, uh, uh. Thoughts are hard. Thoughts are hard. I just. I, t I don't know why I didn't take that. Why did I even... Why did I... I could have just walked over here and taken it. I just overcomplicated it. Such a smart. I'm a smart. Rapture Metro. So, what are we gonna... What shall we talk about today, everybody? Talk about, uh... The Florida trip a bit more. I... Well, you know, my... I learned a lot about my grandparents during this trip. You know, they're really old, like 80, they're 86 and 80 and 83. And there's a there's a tw there's a 60 year age difference between me and my grandfather. And I thought that was just absolutely neat. But there's such a 
that we, we ju we're just so far apart in age. We've experienced totally different things in, in our lives. It's just insane. I am gonna have to... I think I might have to lower the volume on this thing a bit. It's going to not freak the fuck out of me. Yeah. Nah, I gotta keep both of them in. Wait, hold on a second. Okay. Thought I heard my daughter for a second. It's been my daughter's been wonderful. She's on a new sleeping schedule where it's much easier to get her get her to bed now. Just you know, after bath, bop, like a you know, get her dressed, get her in a whoa, whoa. It's that it's that glitch again. Wait, no. No. Oh. It's so freaking weird. But yeah, you know, uh Get her, uh, get her, get her in her pajamas. Get her a bottle. Uh, sometimes we read her story. Sometimes we don't, depending on how on how difficult a day it's been for her. And uh, and then we just give her a kiss, good night, and then it's off to bed. Simple and easy. You know, occasionally she'll she'll cry the moment we leave, but you know that's just. Babies cry sometimes. She doesn't want the day to. She doesn't want the day to end. She wants to keep having fun. This life is a wonderful, fun, joyous world. Why would we ever want it to end? But she usually gets up pretty fast, and if not, we're, we'll we'll go in there like every five minutes, and you know, calm her down a bit, let her know that we're still here. We haven't we have women at the house or around. Oh no! I I didn't ah, uh, I didn't want to hack it. I just wanted to buy something. There we go. And there's nothing to buy. Great. Can't see a goddamn thing. Yeah, it's such a it's such a it's such a Oh. I just wasted a shot. <laughs> that was not a wasted shot. Yeah, it's a much easier sleepy type schedule. And she basically sleeps through the night now, which is just absolutely wonderful. Uh, no, no. Do I have to shoot it? Yes, I do. Whatever. So, and I bet, so, which, which means that I've been able to get through her, uh, through her waking up in the middle of the night stages without having to once change my sleep schedule, and is that a, is that something I should be able to brag about? I don't know, but I'm I'm I am happy about it. Cause how else would I able to be able to find time to play video games, huh? Vigi games, gotta love them. It's wonderful, fun stuff to play. Auto hack. What do we got in here? Let's move on. So, we gotta find Julie Langford, the scientist who is responsible for creating this forest at the bottom of the, sea, at the, bottom of the Atlantic Ocean here. So, let's hop off here. Uh, I think I'm a little, little lost. Whoa. Oh, sugar. I'm spliced up in ways you never dreamed of. <laughs> Get over here. Should have used that line back when I was when I was uh, trying to find a girlfriend. Oh, sugar, I'm splashed up in ways you've never dreamed of. What a I, night oh. I got lined up. Everything's ready: flowers, bottle of wine, even two tickets to the tea garden. Nothing gets the Bettys in the mood like nighttime in Arcadia. Now I just gotta stop by the thrifty care to pick up a med hypo, just to be safe. Word is. This ain't Angelina's first visit to the tea garden. Hmm. I wonder, did they really... Was was Betty's just... Was Betty's really the generic... Basically, essentially the term for chick back in those days? Was it really that term? I mean, I don't know. I'm just curious. Oh, uh, yes. The augmentation procedure is a success. The slugs alone could not provide enough atom for serious work, but combined with the host, now we have something. The slug is embedded in the lining of the host's stomach, and after the host feeds, we induce regurgitation. 
and then we have 20, 30 times yield of usable atom. The problem now is the shortage of hosts. Fontaine says patience, Thunderbolt. Soon, the first home for little sisters will open, and that problem will be solved. Little Sisters Orphanage. <laughs> that was an unnecessary reload. Alright, so we are about wait, let me just let me just survey the Let me just survey this area really quick. Fucking success. Who the fuck is this guy? Fontaine didn't have the stuff. I'll kill him up. Anti personal rounds. Only got five of them, but. There we go. So I think with that. That. Wait one second. Yes, with that, I will end this episode right here. Done. Done enough. No, I've done enough. I've done enough. I'm gonna save the game here. I've been able to test out this camera. Hopefully, everything turns out well, and this is the way. This is the way it is from now, from now on. You're stuck with my face. You're stuck with it. And my man bun. Take care, everybody.